Right now, let's talk about how you can change the side button settings on your iPhone. Let's get into it. So there are some things you can tweak. All you have to do is to open up the settings app like that and make sure you get to the accessibility, right? So on the main page, find and locate the accessibility. And then you can find in the physical and motor section, we have the entire menu for the side button. So when you click on here, there are some options which you can change. It is mostly about the clicking speed. So you can see that I can choose it to be the default, slow or slowest, right? So you can even see a little animation right there. So when I click, for example, the slowest, you can see that it clicks it in the pattern or in the speed, which is going to be applicable. So if I click on default, you can see it is much quicker. And this is the pace that you should use to just press the side button. So quite a useful thing if you are into it or if you would like to customize it. But below, we also have the what happens when you press and hold it. So usually you get to pick between a Siri or a classic voice control, which is like, you know, what was available before Siri emerged, like on the iPhone 4. I believe there was only the voice control and some people kind of prefer it, right? So if I choose it to be this thing, you know, the voice control is kind of a different thing. So you can just say whatever you want, but it's not the Siri uh, assistant, right? Or you can completely turn it off, meaning that if you hold down on the power button or of course the side button, well, nothing really is going to happen, right? So this is what you can do below. We also have the confirmation. So we have the assistive touch confirmation that's kind of getting a little bit deeper and not that useful but these were the two main things that you need to tweak so let me know below in the comments if you have any additional questions most definitely subscribe for more guides and tutorials like this one i try to be as helpful as i can and i publish a lot of things and tutorials here so make sure you stay tuned so again thanks a lot and i'll catch you in the future uploads <laughs>